Welcome back everybody, welcome back to the Doc Squiffy channel. Today we're on the fire stick and we're still getting a lot of people needing a fix and how to access their apps when they've got the grey icon. So the fix for the grey icon, we're going to give you the simplest solution for you. There's a few different solutions out there, there's a few little tips, tricks which can make you find out which app is what, but today we're going to give you the best tip and the best way to access them okay before we do that though if you can do remember to hit that subscribe button on the channel we've got lots of content here for you all on the channel from fixes deleting settings jailbreaking setting up lots on the fire stick and coming on well, later in the week we're going to be doing some new streaming devices again and broadening it out into some more apps again as well so if you're interested in that sort of content for your streaming do hit that subscribe button so as you will see on your fire stick Grey icons appear. I've got one grey icon here. We've got in our se selection of apps, I've got a couple more. I've got one here as well, okay? And they're really annoying. And there's a few options you can do just to figure out what they are. The main thing is what you want to do is find out what they are. So what I've done, you can still use the Wolf Launcher to figure out what they are. So you open up the Wolf Launcher and you can see every single app icon, okay? Everything you have shows up. Since some of the latest um, Fire Stick updates. You can't have the um, you can't have the Wolf Launcher permanently without rolling back some updates, um, blocking certain things. Once you've updated all the way, it's a bit of a fiddle. But you can use the Wolf Launcher no problem just to open up your apps. So what I've done on my device, my first thumbnail here, it is grey, is always Wolf Launcher, okay? And I'm going to show you how to install it and how to move it there. So as soon as I come on my Fire Stick, I can just scroll across. Boom, I'm in here and I can find everything I want. Even if you're just after an app. It's still quicker than going all the way to here. Okay, it's still quicker than holding down your home button. And selecting apps. Okay, because in here you'll still get grey ones. All I do, the first thumbnail, it is grey, I know, I can click on that and it's here. And you can customise this however you want. Downside is when you run it like this, as soon as you push home, you're back to this. But I quite like that because it means I can still get to other things I need. Um, certain Amazon bits I need which aren't built into the wolf, okay? Including things like Amazon Prime and all that sort of stuff which are all here and in your home and stuff like that. So, what we need to do is install this wolf launcher for those who haven't got it. Again, give me your comments and thoughts underneath on this video and any videos you want coming up in the future, let me know in the comments. Right, to install this, we're going to go to Find. We go to Search. We type in here, Downloader. D O W. After a few letters, it will pop up. You can then click it. Here, you need to install this, okay? Get it installed, but do not open it yet. If you're installing it, pause my video. Once it's installed, push play again, and then we need to go over to our settings. Go settings, My Fire TV, developer options, ADB debugging, turn it on, install unknown apps down to downloader and turn it on for downloader. If at this point you just have an on off option, just turn it on. Right. Now we need to open up that downloader app. So go to find, search, type in downloader again. Easiest way for now. Click it. And if you're opening this up for the first time, you click it, you will get a pop up with permissions. You must accept that permission. If you do not accept that permission later on, when you try to install the app, it won't install, and you'll be commenting on my video, it won't install, it's not downloading, it's not installing. This is why, because you haven't accepted it. Right. Now what we need to do is type in here the URL of my website, which is docsquiffy.com forward slash downloads. The link is directly under the video. You can test it out on your mobile phone as well first if you want to go and have a look at the process. So click it on your phone underneath if you want to as well. But if you're doing it on the downloader app, you can type 75726. Click go, and we will, late, we will wait for this to redirect to my website now. Again, while waiting is the prime time for you to give me that thumbs up. Hit a share if you want to. You know anybody who might like this video, and do remember to drop me a comment. Right, we're now going to scroll down. I mean, there's loads of downloads on here, so you might want to check it out. Like I said, on your phone, you might find things you want for your Fire Stick or any streaming service. It does say on there how they work and what devices they go on. Okay, going down, going down. I'm going to keep going all the way down to where it says 
Android Fire Stick TV launches. Amazon Fire Stick TV launches. We click Wolf Launcher. And then we're going to scroll down again, nice and simply, to where it says Download. It's as easy as that, and it will download in seconds on your device. You can then click Install, which is behind my head. Let me hide my head for you. Click Install. Then click Done. And then you click delete. You don't want these excess files blocking up your system. Click delete. Right, now back to your home screen. You will go across to these apps here. And yours will be right at the bottom. The last one will be light, right at the bottom. And for example, how you move it, you select one you want to move. You push the three lines on your remote. And then behind my head again, you, you select move or move to front. Okay, so move it. You can move it all the way up to wherever you want it. So you want it at the beginning there. And then it will always be here. Okay, it's always here. So every time you turn on your Fire Stick now, you can simply just click on it and you're into your Wolf Launcher. This can be customized in many different ways. You can configure it, you can have backgrounds, you can do loads of other launcher settings and other settings. Again, I use it just as a search almost, just to find my apps. Um, it's useful. I, again, you can just ping that and you can find what you're looking for straight away. You can organize it, you can have categories, you can have everything, but I don't like to use it permanently, and using it permanently means you have to stop updates and things like that. Again, if people want videos on how you can stop the updates and how you can put this back on permanently, we can look into it for you. Drop it in the comments for you down the bottom. Right, as always, like I say, if you can, drop that subscribe if that helps you. If you're looking forward to some of the future videos, do follow us. We've got tons of other videos here as well which will help you. And before we leave, a quick word from one of our partners, IP Vanish VPN is linked directly underneath. It will be linked just under the link to my website. If you're after a VPN which comes with a free um, security um, antivirus software for your PC as well, but this VPN will also work on your Fire Stick, your PC, as many devices as you want, unlimited devices that is linked underneath. These are an affiliated link which does help support the channel. So if you are buying a VPN and you are buying IP Vanish, we'd appreciate it through the link. But if you don't want to do that or use our affiliation, you're more than happy to search the IP Vanish. They are a very good VPN, great customer service, and great speeds. Brilliant. That's about me done on that video. I'll be back tomorrow, which will be... Uh, what day are we? Well, it doesn't matter, depending on when you're watching this video. Check out the channel for our next video coming up, and I will see you all soon. Thank you for watching. I've been Doc Swiffy, and I'll see you soon.